So this question looks like a translate word problem question. So the question says the measure of angle A is 7 twelfths pi radians greater than the measure of angle B. So how do I translate that? I am going to just write out that A, right? A is, always means equal, so I'm just saying A is 7 twelfths pi radians greater than angle B. So that means I have what B is, but A is a is the same measurement as angle B plus 7 twelfths pi radians. How much greater is the measure of angle A than the measure of angle B? Well, we already know that. We know it's 7 twelfths pi radians greater. But this time it's asking for it in degrees, right? And disregard the degree symbol when entering your answer. So what we're really focusing on is how do I convert this radian measurement into degrees? How do I go from radians to degrees? So the most important thing to know here is that pi radians is equivalent to 180 degrees, which means I can take this 7 twelfths pi and multiply it by 180 divided by pi, right? So again, 180 and pi are the same things, just different units. So I'm really just multiplying by 1, so I haven't really changed anything. This is perfectly legal to do. Um, this allows me, however, to cross out my pies and leaves me with just my numbers, right? 7 over 12 times 180 over 1, basically. Now, I can, cross, I can simplify this. I know that 12 goes into itself once. 12 goes into 180 15 times. And then all I have left is 7 times 15. 7 times 15 is equal to 105. And don't forget... This is the non-calculator section. Please do feel free to write out all of your math on the test. There's no need to do the mental math unless you're extremely confident that you have it. And usually, even if I am confident, I'll still write it out, right? So, you know, for instance, just to make sure, right? 15 times 7, 7 times 5 is 35. 7 times 1 is 7 plus 3 is 10. So, yes, this is accurate, 105. So our answer here is 105 degrees. Of course, we do not have a degree symbol option on the test, so we just put 105.